Master the art of setting SMART goals. Share, discuss, succeed. Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we are diving into an incredibly useful area of study skills and time management. SMART goals. But we're not stopping at just learning how to create them. We're going to take it a step further by focusing on how to share and discuss these goals with our peers. Why? Because doing so can take your goal-setting game to the next level. So, let's get started. Before we jump into the sharing and discussing part, let's quickly recap what SMART goals are. SMART is an acronym that stands for Specific, Measurable, Achievable, Relevant, and time-bound. These elements help ensure that your goals are well-defined and can actually guide you toward meaningful action. You might wonder, why should I share my goals? Isn't that personal? Well, you're not alone in this line of thinking, but sharing your goals with trusted individuals can provide accountability, insight, and motivation. 1. Accountability. When you tell someone about your goals, you're more likely to stick to them. 2. Insight. Your peers can offer valuable perspectives that you hadn't considered. 3. Motivation. Knowing that someone else is rooting for you can boost your drive to achieve. Alright, so you're convinced that sharing is a good idea. But how should you go about it? Here are some tips. 1. Choose the right people. Share your goals with individuals who are supportive and constructive. 2. Be open but focused. Share not just the goal itself, but also your plans for achieving it. 3. Ask for feedback. Don't just talk. Listen. Maybe your friend has tackled a similar goal and has some wisdom to share. Now, let's put this into practice. If you're in a study group or class, this would be a great time to pair up and share a SMART goal you've set for yourself. Discuss the specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound elements of the goal. Offer each other feedback and consider any tweaks or adjustments. Here's a sample dialogue for how this might go. Person A. My goal is to learn 300 new English vocabulary words in the next two months. Person B. That sounds specific and time-bound. How will you measure it? Person A. I'll use flashcards and aim to master 15 new words per week. Person B. Sounds like a solid plan. But is it achievable? Person A. I think so. I managed 10 words per week before, so with a little extra effort, I can do 15. Person B. Great. And it's certainly relevant if you're looking to improve your English. And there you have it, folks. Today we not only revisited what SMART goals are but also learned the value of sharing and discussing these goals with our peers. Try this out, and I guarantee you'll see your productivity and focus skyrocket. Thank you for tuning in, and as always, if this video has been helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. Until next time, happy learning!